Hi, this is Mato. In this video, I will show the game between Boris Pasky and Mikhail Tal. Game was played in Montreal in 1979. And where is Montreal? Montreal is a city in the Canadian province of Quebec. It is the largest city in the province and the second largest in the country after Toronto. Let's have a look at the game. Boris Pasky had white pieces and he started with d4. Tal played knight to f6, c4, e6, and now knight to f3, avoiding Nimzo Indian defense. It would happen after knight to c3. Then you would have bishop to b4. So knight to f3, and if bishop to b4 now, then perhaps bishop to d2, Bogo Indian defense. So after knight to f3, b6, Tal goes for queen's Indian defense. e3, bishop to b7, bishop to d3, d5, b3, bishop to d6, Spassky castled, Tal castled too, bishop to b2, Knight from b to d7, knight from b to d2, queen to e7, connecting rooks, rook to c1, rook from a to d8, lining rook with white queen, queen to c2. If queen goes to e2, with the idea to push pawn to e4, then we would have knight to e4. So queen to c2 was played. c5. c takes on d5. e takes on d5. d takes on c5. b takes on c5. And Tal has hanging pawns. Queen to c3. Rook from f to e8, bringing rook to semi-open file. Rook from f to d1. And this is critical position for this game. Tal played d4, attacking queen. Pawn takes pawn, pawn takes pawn, and it is white to move. And this is critical position for white now. How should white continue? Should white capture pawn? On d4, this is pawn sacrifice by Tal. Maybe there is a trick. Or should queen be played to a5? What do you think? Boris played queen to a5. We don't know why he didn't capture on d4. Which is the best move in the position? And uh, we don't know what Tal would play. We can only guess. Maybe queen to e5, but this is just a guess. Uh, white is okay. White is a pawn up. Is there a compensation? I don't know. But maybe Boris thought Tal is offering a pawn, I will not take it. Because he surely calculated what would happen if I take the pawn. That's just a guess. Queen to a5. Knight to e5. Knight takes knight. Bishop takes knight. Knight to c4. Attacking bishop. And how would you continue? Would you preserve the bishop? Tal played the best move. Rook to d5, attacking queen, and also rook is lifted to attack white king. Queen to d2. And we have reached critical position of the game. In this position, Tal played a killer move. If you wish, you can pause this video, and you can try to find the killer move 
the tall plate in this position. Are you ready? What did you find? Have you seen this? Bishop takes on h2, check. Boris captured bishop. Rook to h5, check. King to g1. Tal made a move. And Spassky resigned. What is the move? Have you seen this? Knight to g4. And there is no defense. Queen is coming to h4. Well, if king tries to escape, there is checkmate. If queen to f4, how do you stop checkmate now? There is no way to stop checkmate. And, of course, g3 doesn't work to prevent queen from coming to h4 because of rook to h1. Checkmate. Hmm, what a game. What do you think of this game? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.